A hydrogen bus ride in Prague, Minister Mr. Nitin Gudkari's vision for India's hydrogen future. On October 2, Union Minister of Road Transport and Highways, Nitin Gudkari, made headlines as he took a test drive in a hydrogen bus manufactured by Skoda in Prague, Czech Republic. This event underscores India's dedication to exploring sustainable and eco-friendly mobility solutions, highlighting the significance of hydrogen fuel cell technology in reducing carbon emissions and addressing environmental concerns. Hi friend! Welcome back to SciTech Buzz One channel. We wish to sincerely thank all the new subscribers of this channel. We have observed that 92% of our viewers haven't subscribed to our channel. If you haven't as yet subscribed, kindly consider doing so, after watching this video, since it would encourage us to do more. Now let us delve into the analysis of the subject matter. On X, formerly known as Twitter, Office of Nitin Gudkari stated, Union Minister Nitin Gudkari took a test drive in a hydrogen bus by Skoda in Prague, Czech Republic today, showcasing India's commitment to exploring sustainable and eco-friendly mobility solutions. Hydrogen Fuel Cell-Powered Buses, a Sustainable Solution Hydrogen fuel cell-powered buses operate by utilizing hydrogen and air to generate electricity, representing a sustainable and eco-friendly mode of public transport. Gudkari's test drive showcased the potential of this technology in the pursuit of cleaner and greener transportation options. Gudkari's Test Drive in Prague Accompanied by several officials, Nitin Gudkari embarked on a test drive of the hydrogen bus, which was captured in a video posted on social media. The caption accompanying the video emphasized the promise held by hydrogen buses in mitigating carbon emissions and contributing to a more environmentally friendly future. Gudkari's Commitment to Road Safety Prior to the test drive, Nitin Gudkari participated in a ministerial session on road safety at the 27th World Road Congress in Prague. During this session, he reiterated India's commitment to achieving global road safety targets, as outlined in the Stockholm Declaration. In his address, Gudkari acknowledged the significant challenge posed by road accidents in India, despite the country's status as the world's second-largest road network and the third-largest automobile manufacturing hub. He emphasized the need for comprehensive measures to reduce the alarming number of road accidents in India. National Green Hydrogen Mission, India's Ambitious Step In January of the same year, the Union Cabinet approved the National Green Hydrogen Mission, signifying India's ambition to become a global hub for hydrogen technology production, utilization, and export. This mission carries far-reaching implications, as it gradually leads to the decarbonization of industrial, transport, and energy sectors. It also marks a crucial step in reducing India's dependence on imported fossil fuels. Conclusion Nitin Gudkari's test drive in a hydrogen bus in Prague symbolizes India's commitment to sustainable and environmentally friendly mobility solutions. Hydrogen fuel cell-powered buses, as demonstrated by this event, offer a promising alternative to conventional public transportation, significantly reducing carbon emissions and contributing to a cleaner future. Gudkari's participation in the World Road Congress highlighted the pressing issue of road safety in India and reaffirmed India's dedication to achieving global road safety targets. Furthermore, the National Green Hydrogen Mission serves as a visionary initiative that will not only decarbonize key sectors but also strengthen India's position as a leader in clean technology. This test drive in Prague marks a significant milestone in India's journey toward a more sustainable and eco-friendly future. My friend, if you have found any value in this video, then kindly click on like button as an encouragement to create better quality content. Please share this video amongst your family members, friends, and in your social media network so that this information might benefit others. Don't forget to subscribe to SciTech Buzz One channel so that you will not miss out on any of our forthcoming videos.